Hi, my name is Sanne van Doormaal and in this video I'm going to talk about the evidence behind the reality that you attract what you experience with your own thoughts. And therefore I'm going to explain some of these scientific experiments. So keep watching. Dr. Dean Radin and his team have done remarkable experiments to prove the existence of the power of your focus. Their evidence is based on a double slit experiment, but they took it further. I would like to start to begin to explain what the double slit experiment is. How does a double slit experiment work? An electron shooter directs photons towards a surface with two slits in it. What are electrons again? Electrons are part of atoms. Behind this plane, a second plane has been placed, which functions as a screen, which shows where the electrons end up on the screen. This experiment has one outcome when it is observed by a living person and another outcome when no one is observing the experiment. The moment nobody is looking, you see what you see above in the photo, namely a large number of stripes that are less powerful the further away from the center. The clearest line is in the center. However, when people observe it, you can see that the electrons pass through the two slits cleanly and form two almost identical stripes. So this is what happens when no one is focusing in any way on the experiment. And this is what happens when people are present. So this is what happens when no one is watching in any kind of way. And this is what happens when someone is watching in any kind of way. Crazy, isn't it? This alone proves that consciousness has an effect on what electrons do. Let's not forget, electrons are a part of atoms and literally everything is made up of them. Now, this is a really big one to take in, especially if you've never heard of this before, so take your time. Dr. Dean Radin and his team expanded this experiment by placing people two meters away from the experiment. Here, they were brought into meditation and asked to focus on the outcome of the experiment. This is the box containing the double slit experiment. The box is where the slit and the screens are located. You cannot see from the outside what it looks like on the inside. How does the experiment work? People were put into a meditative state. Then, these meditating people were asked to visualize the double slit in their mind and to see in their mind which of the two slits would be the slit the photons would choose to go through. For example, to the left or to the right slit. This research shows that people can indeed influence the outcome of the experiment with their thoughts. They affected the photons shot through the slit. For example, if they would focus on the left slit, then photons would choose that slit to go through. This experiment has, is so decisive and complete that it has a five sigma result. This means that the chance that this experiment turned out by chance or due to flect statistical fluctuation is a maximum of one in three and a half million. Obviously, there is a lot of thought going into things that could influence this experiment. Here are some ways that they came up with solution to these ex uncertainties. Other explanation included in this experiment can be seen here. To see what other measures were taken to make this experiment legit, you can watch the presentation by Dr. Dean Radin. Fearing that the equipment could be affected by a person's actions in the room, the same experiment was conducted with extra spacing through the internet. People from different parts of the world participated. Different experiments around the world 
showed that the physical space between the person and the device is independent of distance. They have also done the experiment with robots. This showed that human consciousness had much more influence on the results of the scores than the presumed consciousness of the robot. What does it say about our thoughts and focus? Consciousness affects our reality and the role that consciousness plays can be proven. Awesome, right? Now, if this is the first time that you hear about this information, I can imagine that you feel like you're going insane. That is completely understandable. Just all you can do for now is let it sink in and perhaps take your time with this. Think about this information. If you could change your focus, what would this change for you? And also, one last thing. If you can influence an experiment with the power of your thoughts or focus, then what would this mean for all the other experiments? For now, this is all I want to share. For more information about the subject, just search the internet. But maybe don't start with the secrets, just a tip. I will very likely come back to this subject. But for now, thank you for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed yourself. See you next time.